Welcome to Upper Michigan Source Weather on Demand. I'm meteorologist Carl Bonak. On the 11th Friday, the high officially as of late afternoon, 73, the low 56. Put it all together close to our average, which is 77 and 55 for this time in July. And with that uh, of uh, 73 and 56. The moisture is increasing out to the west into the upper peninsula. These are dew points, the direct measure of how much water in the air as of late Friday. The uh, dew points in the 60s just starting to work into the western upper peninsula. It looks like uh, gradually our dew points will rise a little bit toward that 60 degree mark. The real sticky air though should stay to our south. And uh, radar and satellite combined show the area of showers that brought up to four tenths of an inch of rain in the Copper Country. Moving off to the east, there are scattered showers and thunderstorms in Minnesota heading to the southeast. And as that uh, frontal system in Minnesota works in, some scattered showers are possible into Saturday, especially over the south and east during Saturday and Saturday evening. The big thunderstorms with severe weather likely staying to our south along this low pressure area and warm front. But again, there's a chance, especially roughly from, oh, let's say the pictured rocks down to about Iron Mountain and southeastward. Highs on Saturday should be warm in the 70s, maybe even near 80 in places like Iron Mountain. Places like Manistique likely to stay in the 60s because of the south wind. It will be warm on Saturday, but things will start to already cool off on Sunday. Here is the uh, big pool of cool air, or as we call it, the uh, summer style polar vortex. It's still forecast to drop to the south and pass right over the Great Lakes. We'll start to see this on uh, Monday, and by Tuesday, that low will likely only be in the southern Wisconsin or the southwestern lower peninsula. That means unseasonably chilly air, and with this pool of cold air coming across, some scattered showers are likely. Your TV six day forecast on Sunday. Look for highs in the 60s north, 70s south, and at this point it looks like minimal chances of rain as drier air begins to work in. But then with that upper low, unseasonably cool Monday and Tuesday with a good chance of scattered showers both days.